<laughs> My first video with the stash, and I am so excited. <laughs> Not about the stash, about Halloween weekends. It has been a really long, sad, like two and a half weeks <laughs> where there have been no shows. And now we get to come in, we get to see scare actors tonight, we get to see one show, and we get to uh, rank all of the haunted houses, which is gonna be so much fun. I cannot wait to see Butchers of Rock tonight. I am so hyped about every single thing that's gonna happen. Today is the very first Thursday of the year uh, for Halloween weekend, so I, yeah, like I couldn't be more excited. I hope you're ready. I hope you're excited too. And let's go. And we're back. It's so nice to be back here at Cedar Point. Um, and of course, I've been here a lot lately, but I uh, there hasn't been shows. And it's just not the same without shows. I do love being back here at Cedar Point though. Um, the only thing that's kind of sad is this oh an empty beach i love being able to see everybody out here it's just so much fun when everything is just completely vibrant but that's not what we have in the fall at least not right away here it is a very windy day i love the the waves super fun and there still may be a few beach days left in the midwest right now but I'm uh, I'm not gonna get those <laughs> but at least not right now but definitely excited to get into the park and to see what things are actually like here at Cedar Point for Halloween weekends on this very first day now initially here we're gonna have a lot of rides that we can hit nothing's really open until eight o'clock it is time for me to grab something to eat so i'll go do that um I might even do it here on the boardwalk and then i am going to get a whole bunch of rides done in this first hour now thursdays this is the thing that you need to do <laughs> with thursday nights thursday nights are vacant there's not as much going on um, so you're gonna be able to ride rides a lot faster you're gonna be able to see the haunts a lot faster but you are going to have a lot fewer shows than you would normally have so these days are magic though if you want to be able to accomplish a lot of things which is partly why we're here today that and just because it's the very first day of the season but we will be covering also what Fridays and Saturdays and Sundays are like too. All right, look at this short line for Wild Mouse. Actually, I kind of love this. Do you think that was intentional? <laughs> in my head canon, that happened on accident, and then they were like, well, let's just put it in his hands. That'd be fun. But yeah, short line here for Wild Mouse. Short line for Tiki Twirl or whatever that's called, Calypso now. We're already getting some great lines here this evening for Halloween weekends. So, we're, like I said, we're gonna be taking advantage of that. But I do have some food I need to grab first. Ooh, I love these. I haven't actually had a meal in here for a little while now, so be nice to try it again. Let's go. All right, now they did say, all right, now they did say that they do not have um, rice in here right now, uh, which seems weird. But I do know that they have a lot of high school groups that come in and help during this time of year and the rice, maybe the rice is just a lot to make or they're just being cheap. I'm gonna give them the benefit of the doubt for right now. But we'll try this again and see what it's like. This is definitely really flaky fish, delicious. Um, not crispy like that nasty stuff that I had. Mm. Perfect crispness on the skin, but not thick at all. 
Um, very flaky. All the way around fantastic. That's very, very good. Fries are well seasoned. Basic steak fries, but they have flavor, so th I love that. Now for all of this for Hollow Weekends, they have the Hollow Ale that you can get, Pumpkin Spice Ale. I might have to try that, but I'm not sure if I like it or not. Uh, they do have some frozen drinks that you can get. Hey, how are you doing? Doing good, how are you? Good. And then also some classic cocktails and signature cocktails too. All right, I got the Apple Butter Old Fashioned. It smells very like a lot more sweet than some of the normal um, old fashioned smell. Oh. Ooh, it's got a nice like appley kick. It says our seasonal approach to the traditional old fashioned with a hint of caramel apple and Midwest charm. It definitely tastes Midwest. It has that kind of a vibe to it. I love it. I am a Midwestern guy. I mean, it works for me. Definitely good. Let's keep moving on. Also, I love the little touch of decorations in here, too. I just had to come out here and see these beautiful waves. This is such a pretty place, especially on a windy day. I love it. All right. So, we are going over to Gatekeeper. I just recently re-watched my very first Cedar Point video, and this was the very first ride that I did. So, <laughs> we're gonna have to go check that out. Let's go. Obviously, it's a ride that I love to do over and over and over again. It is one of my most enduring favorite rides, even if it's not everyone's favorite ride. Lines are so low that I'm forced to sit here with this beautiful view behind me while I drink my drink. Because <laughs> I'll just walk straight up on the platform. So, and all of the rides are like that. Like this would be the time I would choose a ride with a larger line. Probably like Millennium has a bigger line right now. It's just not worth it to do that when I've got this starting. So, just gotta finish it, let's go. But let's just say you didn't get a drink right now. You could have done probably three different rides by this point. Um, so I would recommend maybe not getting a drink as the first thing that you do in the day so that you can get in. Look, here's some characters coming into their spot right now. Also, Mr. Midnight's house is right down here. And also you can go to Kooky Crafts over here. Here's Mr. Midnight's house. Look at all those hotties. All of them flirting with me too. Shameful. It's the mustache. <laughs> That old fashioned was absolutely delicious. I highly recommend. Um, definitely really, really good because it just has a hint of sweetness. I don't like particularly sweet drinks, but having just a little bit of sweetness from that apple and that caramel, perfect. And we are headed in to Gatekeeper right now. All right, and let's go. Midnight is not open yet. Not quite sure what time it will open or if we're just a little bit early. Oh yeah, it's still 7.36. So it won't open until eight o'clock. So we have plenty of time to hit a whole bunch of rides right now. And we're gonna try to hit as many coasters as we possibly can. And then we'll start doing a couple of shows and haunts. All right, now here is the skeleton crew. Now this is a stage that is more of a tumbling act. And I'm really, I mean, that looks pretty small for it to be a tumbling act, but I'm really excited to see it. So, okay, it looks like there's a platform up there too. It looks like they probably are jumping up there and then jumping back down onto this, I'm assuming is a trampoline. Um, so definitely excited. I cannot wait to see more of that. Uh, we're gonna find out more about that in a day. I'll see it tomorrow. So <laughs> right now we have other fish to fry and I'm not talking about what I just ate at the Grand Pavilion. Instead, we're gonna go to Wild Mouse. And I just found a little shortcut, so yay me. Oh, it's closed though. 
So we're not doing that. We're moving on to the next ride instead. But I see some clowns, some spooky clowns. Uh, these are a bit scarier than I would expect to be up here, but they're gonna be less likely to try to scare you up here because this is more of a family friendly area. Hey. <laughs> okay, now the only thing that could make this better would be if they actually had people up on top of it doing stuff. That's what I would love to see. It makes me sad that they're not. Love to see some sort of an act, some sort of singer or something up there. But obviously that wouldn't be happening today anyway, but I don't think that's happening regardless. But there is a nice little spot to grab drinks still left over from uh, Boardwalk Nights if you would like to do it. Now remember, this whole area is the Bone Walk and they've really upped what they're doing for that this year in comparison to other years. The first day of the season for Halloween weekends is the perfect day to try to do everything as far as the rides go, especially the coasters. Um, because the new thing right now is the haunts, especially on Thursdays, everyone has been able to ride all of the coasters, but they haven't been able to do the haunts. So that's the new thing in town. So the haunts have the lines. The coasters do not. So it's easy in an hour to get through a whole bunch of stuff mm -hmm. and then get doing a few haunts later on in the night. Speaking of coasters, we are now headed for Val Raven. Oh, or maybe we're not. Looks like it might be stuck on the on the track there, which means it's not going. If it doesn't move pretty quickly, it's not going. So instead, we're just gonna keep the trajectory we had, which was to head back toward Iron Dragon, uh, Rougarou, and Millennium Force. Always be observant here at Cedar Point. There are often times when things look like maybe that's where you'd like to go. But if you look deeply and you think, about where you're actually headed, you're gonna realize that things are actually stopped at the time. So you don't wanna do that. Now, I think I'm headed to go to Iron Dragon right here, but right in front of Iron Dragon is one of the things I am most excited about for Halloween weekends altogether, and it is the Shrieks. I love the Shrieks. I cannot overstate how much I love the Shrieks. Iron Dragon says a five minute wait. Which I think is probably very realistic because there's nobody in line. So let's go. All right, and here we go. Let's hop on it. Let's go. Look who I found. Oh, hey. 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 Who's ready to go? Joker Adventures. It's eight o'clock. It's time to go. Let's go. Want? Yes. I told you guys you should hang Where with me and you, you wouldn't come. Hey. Did you get your hair cut? I like it. Guys, we found some cool people. Cool. And we also found some, okay, losers just like me, but still. Oh, I was talking about that. Hi. Oh, hi. Oh, <laughs> All right, we are hitting Iron Dragon. No weight whatsoever. Let's go. Here we go. One more time on to Iron Dragon. Let's go. It looks like the train might be closed on Thursday nights. Also, I'm pretty sure Rougarou is, and I'm pretty sure Val Raven is. But now we're on our way to go hit a couple of haunted houses because it's after 8 o'clock. So it's time to hit haunted houses, right? All right, we're going to rank all these and have some fun with them. So let's go. They do have another little beer stand right over here too. 
along with a picture opportunity over here. Remember, Hollow Weekends is going through November 2nd this year, so make sure to make plans for that. Come after Halloween. You'll enjoy it. You'll love it. Just like that. I know. I hear. I'm scared. And here at the Red Garter Theater, or Red Garter Saloon, I guess, this is the Fangs. Now, obviously, they're not playing tonight. I'm super excited to watch them and I actually got to see them just a little bit ago also. Um, they were just walking around getting ready to ride some rides. <laughs> Cannot wait to see this cast. Um, definitely so excited. All right, let's go. Next thing. Unless you want a drink. All right, another drink. I wish I was asking about the fangs. I can't wait to see the fangs. I wish, he, I wish we knew what? Do we know about the fangs right now? When they're going to be playing? Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Yeah. I don't know specifically. I'll find them though. It's not that hard. We have a drink. And we're headed into a scare zone. <laughs> oh, we're in the scare zone. All right. Warning, nightmares ahead. And here's where it gets busy because this is what everyone is looking for tonight. <laughs> hey! How did I know I'd run into you guys tonight? I walked in the park and I said, I bet we run into Trent today. Yeah, why? Every time. I always oh, run into you guys. Nice. I'm already modeling with my with my open shirt too. Open shirt. Yeah. Full, full mustache. Full shave mustache. Full shave mustache. That's right. That's right. Hey guys, how y'all doing? Why is it so hot? It's fall. It's not okay. It feels wonderful. I'm mad about it. It's not technically fall yet. I've been like running around trying to ride rides. You guys have just been live streaming. We've just been sitting right here. <laughs> for like an hour and ten minutes, we secured the prime rocking chair. But look, look how cool! It this looks. is this is why you're primo. It's it's prime scare. I know. Look at that. It's prime scare Ooh. night, and the signal's holding up, which is the best. We're afraid to move. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Right it there. could fall apart at any it other point. Fall apart. With this, like, Everywhere. A tag mode, so if one is also in green, you can. Yeah. Kind of oh, is this part okay. of that new thing? You yeah. can yeah. tag out other people's lanterns. Ooh. Oh, you can tag them. Yeah. Oh, this is what our tag should be. Hey, can you can you like do something for us? Can we see? We <laughs> do ballet. Absolutely, make some sparks for us. <laughs> yeah. He's like, I know. Stop it. All right, you guys, it's really good to see y'all. Have a good one. Bye. See, you. yeah, good to see you too. Can y'all do some sliding? Anybody of course. Okay, can I see you? Of course. Yeah! I'm not carpet bagger, but I do look an awful lot you like do. it. Yes. Copyright, sorry. Come here. Come here. Okay, come here. Okay. You brave? I'm brave, yes. How far apart can you spread your toes? <laughs> oh, shoot. Okay. Point your knees out like you're on a horse. Perfect. <laughs> Don't move! <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> I was afraid I was never going to have kids again. It's okay, me neither. <laughs> Blood on the bayou, into the fog. Okay, this is a very, very long line. It will take a long time, and it's gonna feel like it kind of never ends. You're gonna get to where you need to be, though, okay? Just follow the lights. Trust the process. Trust the process, that's right. We changed this. Was it scary? Yes. Yes, good. Was it true? All right, this is different here. Stay to the right. Oh, this is- Oh. Oh, no. Oh, shoot. 
We don't like this, but Yoko likes it even less. We don't like it? <laughs> I like the new edition. Oh wow, they have this way better setup than last year. There's someone in jail over there. He got into the fog. Yeah, <laughs> hey, I have this tent. It's a I want to see inside too. these. I, How cool look. are they? I know. They're so cool. This what if I got scared and spilled Wait, my beer all over here? That was a oh, How long Oh, the been high here? ground. Oh, it's always been here. Yeah, it's always, it's always been, always been here. No. Yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> Walked right into that one. <laughs> Walked right into that one. <laughs> Ooh, this is new up here. They've they've utilized the stage now instead. They've made it a little bit shorter. What's the fog gonna do to us? Oh, okay. Nothing scares me anymore. I'm too desensitized to it. Well, fun fact, I don't Oh, no. Oh, hey! That one was kind of fun. Yeah, they made it shorter than last year, which I appreciate. It was a bit too long last year. I love that it's short. Even though it was fun, it's just... I love that. Yeah. Yes, I guess so. Did you just apologize to a monster? I mean, you deserve respect. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, we are headed into Slaughterhouse. Let's go. By the time we get up to the front of all of this, all these cattle pins will actually be ready to go right in. There goes Millennium Force. Here is where we have gotten to the line so far. We don't have very far at all. It'll be maybe 10 minutes at most. So Coaster Cat just said this is actually kind of perfect theming because the cattle pin makes you feel like cattle coming in. And uh, yeah, I would kind of agree. All right, so this is Beth's first time going through any of these. How was the last one? It was fun. It was yeah? Fun. Yeah, I liked it. Yeah. It wasn't too bad. <laughs> All right, so we'll see what she actually thinks. Thank you. All right, we can, I was told we can actually film in here, which is awesome. I got pig feet, I got cow head. What do y'all want? <laughs> Style! Oh, <wow. laughs> Hello? feels disgusting guys ew oh oh i really don't like that hey <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> hey, look, it's Jen. I know it's Jen. How That's you why we doing? came here. I know. That's why we followed you. That's more scary than the Hey, let's go to Corn Maze. Corn Stalkers. Corn Stalkers. Hey, they have something new up here. I can hear it. The skeleton talks. They know everything. They know everything. I mean, I guess. Uh, it's talking to you? Oh, is everyone gonna record me? Hi, is skeleton! Can you be my dad, please? Alright, guys, let's go to Corn Stalkers. Can you be my dad? No, my favorite movie hey. is Sucker Punch. No, I'm not Actually, it's Batman because all the parents are gone. Here we are at Midnight Elixirs. Let's see what they have. Which one? Okay. I think I have to. Hey, how are you doing? Pretty good. What can I do? Good. I think I have to get the Ivan to drink your blood. I want to drink It's always my favorite one. Yeah. Does it come with the teeth this year, too? The teeth? They had teeth last year. This has a syringe in the cup. I like the syringe, but I miss the teeth. Okay, let's do it. All right, guys, come to see Adelina and Alex. They're amazing. Here at, this is Blood Bar, right? And Trail Tavern. Cool, cool, cool. Midnight Elixirs. And Trail Tavern. Oh, Midnight, sorry. Midnight Elixirs, okay. You know what? Stop it. All right. Now, guys, we've got a really cool drink here. This is my favorite one right here. Get that blood in there. Watch it slowly go in. Oh, that was not slow, but okay. There we go. Oh, look how creepy that is. Let's try it. Mm. It's lemonade and it has like a strawberry like elixir in it. It's so good. Midnight elixirs, come check it out. Let's go. Coaster Cat got the vampire's kiss. Now this is a non-alcoholic bag of a drink. It's about time for me to eat, 10 o'clock. Oh shoot! We're headed to the restrooms right here. They do have restrooms at the back and it's very necessary after three drinks here. We are headed up to go see the Butchers of Rock, which are going to be starting here in just a second. I'm very excited to see them and they're the only performing group that's happening tonight. But either way, we'll walk through the scare zone and then we'll wait for it. We've got some drinks to finish up. We got 20 minutes. Which will be pretty fun. We've got 20 minutes. I know, I'm so excited. Hello! I'm the best groupie I've ever walked. Can you be my groupie? I love the clown. Can you be my groupie? <laughs> That's unsettling. Oh, I can follow you? Yeah, come on. Okay. I got someone I want to show you. Okay. Come on, you guys. I see me, I had those last year. They broke. We've even got the mesh shirts with the guys here, too. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah VIP. VIP. VIP? I've never met this one before. Oh, 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 yes. You need to scan need the barcode. Oh, you're going under her legs? <laughs> you're going under her legs? Oh, no. Sorry, I stepped on you. Whoa. You made it. You guys are amazing. Get over there. Oh, wow, okay. Nice, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha
problem. Scare zone here. I am so close to the beginning. Of a new show here at Lusty Lil's Palace Theater. I cannot wait. You have no idea how excited I am. 10 to 15 minutes. Oh, entrance ahead. Nope, nope, nope. Entrance ahead. No line. Ooh, new lights. 
I like all the lights that they've added into this queue. This used to be such a dark queue. This is a fast line. Club Orpheus. So excited to see it again this year. All right, they did not let me film in there, but it was definitely really fun. Very enjoyable. Again, kind of a party. Nothing really scares me anymore, to be honest. Um, but definitely still really, really fun. I enjoyed that a lot. What'd you guys think? Very more be a shield. I like it better. Than what? I like it better than Slaughterhouse. But better than Slaughterhouse, yeah. I might agree with that, actually. Yeah, they were very interactive. And one yeah. of them knew my name. Yes, they did. They, they said, said, not your normal not guy, your help normal me. Guy, help and then me. somebody said, you better take care of your friends. Oh, really? Somebody said something along the way. Well, what's that mean? That's oh. ominous. Okay, now we are doing our list of haunted houses. Like Steel Vengeance has a 10 minute line and a five minute line for Fastlane. This first night is the night to hit coasters if you don't care to ride the, or to see the haunted houses. Yes, jump through cutthroat to go, yep, yep. Okay, so we are headed out to Cutthroat Cove, which is our next spot, because it'll take us right down to Cornstalkers, and then from Cornstalkers, we can hit that and head up to the front and do our last couple of haunted houses. Hey. No, you said go ahead. Alrighty, friends. The pirates <laughs> will not touch you, so please do not touch them. There is no running, no sudden stopping, or no cell phone use while you are in the cove. Now, once again, for this one, they told me I could do it, but they told me I could because this camera doesn't have a screen. So we'll see if it's okay or not. <laughs> I'm a little bit uncertain as to what the rules are, but I'll do whatever they tell me to do. Oh my word, look at this lady up here dancing. Hi. Dancing for us. Can I get oh. stroke? <laughs> Ah, yes! Wow. Yes! The favorite of the people! I'm married! <laughs> I know, she was into me. Have a bite! It was me! No, she was into me no. first. It was you! It was me. <laughs> <laughs> oh. you, what language are you speaking? Uh oh. So get me out of here. Okay, so when you get right up to here. You can get right into Cornstalker's line, and Cornstalker's line doesn't have anybody in it at all. Is this the line? All right, so we come down here. It looks like they have closed off, actually, the line. Oh. So we don't actually use the extended line, which is where we would get in right here. That's what they used to organize it, because it's always a yes. But since it's closed off right now, we're not getting into that, and we just walk around into the main uh, line. Yep, we're going on Snake River Falls. Oh my gosh. Hold on, you're gonna get wet. This is, everybody's gonna get wet. Now this is how long of a line you usually wait with tons of people all around. This queue is usually really packed. So expect that. Or if you follow what I usually tell you, do not get in this until do not get in this line until about 11 o'clock. If you get in this line at 11 o'clock, you won't have a wait at all. Are videos allowed or not? No. Okay, turn it. All right. So that one officially scared me way more than the others. Um, so far today, all of them have just made me laugh. That one genuinely 
kind of made me feel tense. I mean, I still laughed, but it made me actually feel tense and kind of scared about what was going on. Honestly, What'd you guys think? Scariest What'd you guys think? I like that one. Scariest by far? Your favorite so far? All right. Let's go back to Fear Ground Freak Show. <laughs> yeah, they're really being fun. There's a lot of time. Like it's not always scary. Yeah. But they're fun. They're they're being they'll they'll tease back with you. They'll yeah. It's scary at first, but then they're like that was funny, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like they'll laugh at you or they'll yeah. It's not just jump scare. Because, I yeah. mean, after it's so like, long, it stops being that scary. But it is really fun when they're interactive with you. All right, we are going to hit Farmhouse Kitchen and Grill next. Hey, can I get the grilled chicken drumsticks, please? I'll do the smashed fried potatoes. No wait at all here in Farmhouse Kitchen Grill. Okay, now I have not tried this at all yet, so it'll be fun to try it and see what it's like. Okay, let's try these. Mm. Mm, these are good. Give me a bite. You want one? Yeah. Mm. You like it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. These are really good. You're gonna do a mukbang? Mm -hmm. Same. Okay, Liv, it's mukbang time. Mukbang. <laughs> we got the... As always, really good. Good. These garlic mashed potatoes are the best I've ever had. Did you say mashed They are so garlicky. So buttery. They're exactly what I want. This whole meal right here couldn't be better. Getting in, we go in and around the house, all the way around. There's a trash can in there. Oh, is there a trash can? <laughs> Drew, you should be a scare actor. No, I got better things to do with my life. All right, I think that that one legitimately got me a couple times. The other one kept me smiling the whole time. This one, to me, was the scariest one. It was weird. Omnipresent, omnipotent, master skull has returned. Yeah, He's back! The, back. Has the, the, has yes. the microphone works now. Hello, Kyle. Why are you running? Run, Forrest, run! Get to the top. <laughs> it's the only way out! <laughs> There's no way out! <laughs> You're amazing! That's the only thing I wouldn't do that's a very short list to go through the bottom. By that, my son! <laughs> Make sure you get the Clark the in the background, is it there? Yeah, is there Clark? That's new. I want a photo op. Alright, we have 12 minutes, so if we play our cards right, we might be able to do both. The problem is, if there's enough people in line, we probably need to walk all the way around. Which kind of stinks because it's gonna take up a lot of time to walk around. But we might be able to do that though. There it is. But yeah, I don't think they're gonna let us go in through the fast lane. This might be the last one that we hit, but we'll see if we can make it over to Mr. Midnight just in time for the last minute. If not, I'll be back tomorrow anyway. So I have to see what actually happens. Let's go and see if we can do it. All right guys, that has gotten a nice refresh. Definitely really fun. Um, it was kind of an update on the idea. It's more to do with like the paranormal society stuff like that um more high tech 
Um, there actually were some scares that really did kind of get to me and scare me a little bit, which is definitely fun. I love it when there's something that actually kind of hits me and uh, I'm not just laughing at things, so. But we are now on our way. We have five minutes to get to Mr. Midnight. We don't have long. Let's go. This is our last one. It looks like we're gonna make it. We've got about two minutes left until the park closes. So we've got the Midnight Haunted House. Let's see what time it is officially. 11.58 right now. None of the rides have any lines. Now I'm not sure if that'll be indicative of every Thursday night, but early on, you're gonna see a lot of that. We're about to see Mr. Midnight, that's right. That's right. This is a cool entrance. They just updated this. That's cool. All right, that one was so much fun. Um, there's just a lot of really cool stuff in there. And again, it's gotten a lot of a refresh. So like all of these haunted houses, yes, they're all the same as last year, as far as name goes, but there's been some big changes to each one of them, which I appreciate. I think that's actually kind of cool. What'd you guys think about Midnight? Midnight was fun. Really fun, really like, good. <laughs> I can't tell you every secret, but it was like, there was some, there was some, there was some stuff. There's a lot of really fun stuff in there. Um, and cool optical illusions also. Um, I definitely enjoyed that. Uh, Coaster Cat, what's your, what are your top two? So my top two are gonna have to go to that being number one. And I would say for my second, I'm gonna pick Corn Stalkers. Corn Stalkers? And my, like, my least favorite two are gonna have to go to uh, Blood in the Bayou and then Beer Ground Freak Show, just boring. Yeah, okay. What are your top two? Uh, I think this one is number one, Midnight. Okay. And then my next one, hmm, Slaughterhouse was pretty fun actually. Slaughterhouse, yeah. okay. And then bottom would be uh, Blood on the Bayou for sure. There wasn't much going on. Yeah. And then uh, Freak Show, yeah. Freak Show? Okay. <laughs> what are your top two? My top two are definitely Where are you? gonna be corn stalkers and what was that a freak show. Freak show? But my favorite fun one without the scares, with the best theming, with the most fun inside, would be midnight. Bottom two? Bottom two? What are the other two? Blood on the bayou. Blood on the bayou. Eh? <laughs> uh, and then uh, Slaughterhouse. Ugh. Slaughterhouse, boring. okay. Yeah, the first ones that we did did seem a bit more boring. So I'm going to go bottom to Slaughterhouse and uh, uh, Blood on the Bayou. I think Blood on the Bayou at the bottom. And then for the top, I'm going to have to say, um, I think I do have to say Midnight. I kind of wanted to go not fun. like everybody else but i like midnight best only gonna get but um i do want to let everybody know at the same time this is the first night yeah it's not even opening night this is like the first night preview preview oh uh, this is opening night it's opening night but the ceremonies come tomorrow yes so we'll see a lot more shows and stuff over the next several days um but we, thank goodness we did hit all of the haunted houses um my favorite though on top of that i think i still may have to do uh bloodbath i love bloodbath it's always one of my favorites so i think i may have to say that one so although my favorite area was definitely the clown posse stuff <laughs> yes. definitely by far my favorite area they just all together but that was because they were really humoring us and having fun all together everyone's having fun everyone's enjoying themselves and that's what makes this event great. So thank you guys so much for joining me. Press that subscribe button, like button. I'm about to run out of batteries and let's go. 
Hey, thanks for watching. I release theme park related videos at least a couple times a week, so press that subscribe button if you made it this far. Also, check out similar videos in the playlist to the right or find my newest video to the left. Thanks again, and let's go!